Hey guys, a bit of a different video. Um, I was just getting a bit tired of all the trips to the thrift ones. I've got like another five or six of them in the pipeline. Uh, so they'll be up in the next few weeks. Obviously every Sunday is when I post most of the time. Uh, but yeah, different video. Uh, it's going to be all the kids shoes um, that I've picked up over the past like three or four years. I don't really know why I do it, but I just like all the old early 2000s Nike silhouettes. But I've got a bit of everything here. I've got like some early 2000 ones and then I've got like late teens. 2015 2017 uh, but yeah I just pick up ones which I think are cool um, I'm not too sure how this video will do if people like it or not uh, but make sure to leave a like subscribe if you're new here and for my Instagram and my Depop down here at the bottom of the screen Ryan's finds R H I N D S F I N D S. I'll try and do it in the audio that I found them um, but yeah it's just probably gonna be like a big jumble of just everything that I found uh, but yeah hope you enjoyed the video starting with the first shoe uh, I picked these up in early 2018 um, I'm not too sure why, but these started the whole obsession with just picking up cool early 2000s Nike silhouettes. Uh, but I grabbed these, I think it was because of the swoosh I liked, just the red on yellow. Just a pretty standard kid shoe, uh, Velcros, I think they're from 2012, got your gum sole. I picked them up for like a quid and yeah, this started the whole obsession with collecting really cool shoes. Getting into the next shoe, I've got three colorways of this pair. Uh, I want to say they're called Nike Freeze just because it says literally Nike Free there. Uh, but this pair is from 2015, just a red colorway. And then these two other two pairs are both from 2017. We've got the blue and then the green. We'll quickly get these newer models out of the way and then we'll get into the proper early 2000 silhouettes. Kids MX 95, I'm not too sure why I picked these up, but they're from 2017. I got them in like a little bundle. Um, they're all whites, pretty standard. And then we've got a pair of Air Force Ones from 2015, uh, just your black suede. Pretty nice pair. Um, I think I paid like a quid or two. Um, with all these pairs, they literally cost me, I don't think any of them cost me over a fiver. Um, but yeah, still a bit of a weird thing to do, but just pick up cool pairs. Next, we've got the pair that I picked up most recently. Uh, they're Jordan 5s. I believe the colorway is called Laney White, and they're from 2013. This is the only kids Jordan that I have. Um, just a really cool colorway and just super good condition wise. Now we're getting into some of the really good early 2000 pairs. Uh, this is one pair that I don't know the name of, um, I don't know the silhouette or anything like about it. I could probably find it out if I typed in some of the numbers into Google. Um, but they're very similar to Air Force Ones, but I'm not too sure. If anyone knows what the actual silhouette is, um, comment down below. I think I picked this up for like a quid exactly. It was either last year or it might have been late 2018. Now I've got a couple of box pairs to show you. You can tell just from the box what sort of era they're from. These are called Nike Lil, as in L-I-L, Sprint Sister 63. I'm not too sure if the 63 is part of the name, uh, but this is the smallest pair that I've got. I found these in a charity shop for, I think, a fiver, and they're completely dead stock. They are tiny, as you can see by the size of them. Um, yeah, brand new in box. They even, they've even got the price tag there. Um, if you're from the UK, you'll know that's from Sports Direct. They cost, what is it, 16 pound, nine pence back in the day, really cool pair, brand new in the box. The box is tiny and just a really cool one to add to the collection. Then we've got another box pair, again, O2000 box. Uh, these are called the Nike First Crawler and I believe these are from 2001. I got these from the Datastock Nike guy uh, this year. It was probably two, two or three months ago. Um, didn't pay too much for them. They've just got a simple swoosh. They're sort of like socks. I thought they were sort of like water-based shoes, um, but they're just toddler ones really. Uh, just got that simple swoosh there on, on the sock part and just a rubber sole. Brand new, dead stock. Um, again, just another cool one to put in the collection with the box. These last three pairs are my favourites. Uh, just really good colourways and really good silhouettes. Uh, we'll get into the first one. A pair of Nike Shocks in like a really nice ice white baby blue colourway. Super clean uppers as you can see. Uh, they're from 04, I believe. Yeah, 04. Um, I don't find too many shocks. I've got one pair in my size, which I found in 2018, I think. They're like black and orange. Um, in terms of selling them, I do sell like adult ones for like decent prices, probably around like 25 to 45. It really depends on the condition because they're really hard to find in good nick. Most of them are like really trashed and like they get all the mud in between all the shock bits. Um, so they're really hard to clean. Uh, but yeah, that's the first pair of shocks. Then we've got another pair of shocks in a like nice red, or well, it's meant to be white, but it's it's yellowed a little bit just from wear. Um, I think that's 3M on the back there as well. Uh, but these are also from 2004. 
I found these last year. I think it must have been like the last one or two car boots of the year of the season. Um, but yeah, didn't cost me too much. Really cool colorway. Now onto my final and favorite pair of kids Nike shoes. Uh, I found these this year and they're just the coolest. This is the best Air Force One colorway I've ever found um, in kids and adults. I'm not too sure what the actual colorway is called. They give me proper Easter vibes. Um, if you know what the Easter Air Force Ones look like, I'll put a picture up here. I think they are released in like 2018. They sort of remind me of these ones. But obviously these ones are white instead of like the whole thing being colored. But yeah, overall, just a really good colorway and the condition is literally flawless. They've been worn hardly. The star count is perfect. But they're just the best colorway of Air Force Ones I've ever found. That is it for all the kids shoes that I've got in my collection. I wouldn't really class it as a collection. I sort of just pick them up if I see them at car boots or charity shops. Uh, but yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Bit of a weird one, bit of a short one today. Uh, but I just needed to change it up, as I said earlier in the video, uh, just from the usual trip to thrifts. As I said, I've still got a few more trip to thrift videos to do, and then I'll start changing up. I've got like some collection ones that I need to do. I've got like probably like 30 kids pieces under there. Um, all really good, like high-end designer bits, good Nike bits. Uh, I can do that. I can do like unwearable Air Maxes. Uh, what else can I do? Hats. Just a bit of everything. Comment down below if you want to see any other collections. I also need to do my collection, uh, my Nike t-shirt collection and my vintage t-shirt collection. I think I said I was going to do it at like a thousand subs, but I just want more people to be subscribed before I upload that. Uh, but yeah, comment down below what videos you want to see. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, follow my Instagram, my Depop down here at the bottom of the screen. Ryan's Finds, I-H-I-N-D-S, F-I-N-D-S. Thanks for watching. Peace.